nice and cool in the shade. Lovely, absolutely beautiful. The views are open right up. So I've just walked up here and the views have opened right up. Still warm though, 10, 11 degrees. Feels warmer, feels warmer. So it's only a short hill, nice easy climb. It's, it's steep, but it's short. Uh, I've never really done this one before, but it looks amazing. It looks amazing on photos, so we'll give it a go. Just a nice chill camp. I can see I get down early, back for work. Jobs are good. Yeah. I'm testing out a new pack. It's a Z pack. Uh, Arc Hall 50. If you're in America, Z pack. I'm not going to say that. Because I'm not in America. I'm in the UK. And it's Z. So I'm testing this out. I think it weighs about, um, it's about 600. 640 grams, so it weighs nothing, it's frameless. Well, it's got a slight frame in it. Um, managed to get two hip belts for it. So, we'll see. It's a roll top uh, roll top bag. So, it, it's quite easy to pack. Uh, to be honest, it was quite a joy packing. I love my Osprey, it's comfy as anything, but I think this is, it's a lot more of a joy to pack. It's straight in, no messing. Uh, but, we'll give it a go. We'll see what it's like. It's just a short one, this, but... We'll, uh, we'll see what it's like. It's comfy so far. I thought I didn't think I'd get away with it with it being. And like you see, it's got a slight frame in it, just like a really slight, thin frame. But time will tell. But hopefully, I'll change my bag. I'm going to change my summer bag to a slightly warmer, lighter, lighter bag. Um, and then, obviously, I've got the Hilleberg solo on us today. So I'm going to change the shelter, probably knock it down to about uh, either, either get a new one. Uh, or use the lanchan, or use both, get a new one and use the lanchan. So either way, I'll be down to about a kilogram for me tent. Maybe it's about 500 grams for me, me sleeping bag. So, which will compare to what I've got now, as well as the space, it'll save us maybe 1.5 kilograms, possibly two kilograms. Um, I might even buy a, a lightweight camera, just when I want to just, just fly up places and or do distance. Um, I mean, I'm still getting a grip with this Panasonic and I love it, but uh, it's, it's full frame camera, it is it is bulky. So I might get a lightweight camera. I might just see if I can go all out and just just lighten the load. It's uh, it's a lot easier than getting fit. <laughs> no, I'll just get fit as well. So I'm anyway, enough gassing. Let's get up there. See he's at the top. Breath of wind. The views down to Old Water, Cody Bridge. What a deer! Moon's air uh, doing its thing. So there you go. Short little climb up 
and I should be on Glenridden Dodd. Potential spot. We'll have a walk down here. It's just on the little brow of that hill there. That could be another potential spot. The beasties are they're out in force because the uh, oh, because the wind is non-existent, which is good for the drone, but it's also good for other flying creatures. So hopefully it picks up just a little bit, just enough, enough to send them, send them on a little journey somewhere. Right. Looks like an easier spot to walk on. Not deep mud. Surprised if you don't see an adder with it being early part of the year and a nice bit of sun. Very surprised. I thought we'd have seen one or two by now. Oh, well, this is a spot. I think this is it. Right then, I'm gonna pitch here. Got a nice view all the way down to the water, Foley Bridge. Nice view of the surrounding fells. That'll do me. So, it's time to get, um, time to get packed up. Oh, set up even. Not packed up. We start here. Shining. This is the new pack. Fantastic. Really chuffed with it. I'll give you a, a better view and a little tour of it. That's me view. Oh. Coffee. I'm going to cook up a storm tonight. I see a storm. It's just simple, hearty food. No messing. Right then, I'm going to get the tent set up. I'm going to pitch here. Door facing down there. Sunrise is going to be across that way. So. Let's get set up. Firstly, big hoops. Who doesn't love a big hoop? Let's get some of this crap out first. It is going to be cold tonight. It's uh, it's going to feel like minus four, I think. It doesn't it doesn't really feel like it like that at the minute, but I've done it enough to to realise how much it can change. So got me winter bag. That's going soon. First aid kit. I always carry that. Tick to everything in it. And lastly, Hilleberg Solo. Definitely the wrong tent, I think. 
because I got my winter pack, and um, my winter bag. I could have gotten away with um, my lanchan, would have been perfect. But never mind, it's what it is. I'm not going to stress about that one. So, I'll get this tent up and I'll, um, I'll bring his back. Oh. Right, and guys, that's the tent all pitched. All my kit sorted out. I've got my food there in the shade. Um, I've got a nice little treat tonight. Proper hearty food. My water's there in the shade. Um, I've got a bottle of wine. Just a little bottle of red. Just a cheap one, but it's quite nice actually. McGuigan Estate, Merlot. Merlot. So, everything's sorted out. I need to put my pack away. And I think what I'm going to do is, while the sun's starting to drop, I might get the drone up uh, and send it out, because, <laughs> why not? Because it's absolutely fantastic. Absolutely tremendous. Beautiful. Another breath. Well, it's coming in a tad fresh now. Eight degrees. I've got a thermometer there. I'll leave that there all night. I'll put this in my sleeping bag. Uh, so you know how warm I am inside. But now the sun's sun's dropped behind the hills, the mountains. It's uh, they're like a sunlight. If it's the, you can feel the, the temperature drop immediately. I'm glad I brought my gloves now. Oh. But I'm going to get some food on. I'll let this breathe a bit. But I'll leave that lid off. I'll let that breathe. And um, I'm going to let it breathe on the rocks so it doesn't fall over. Oh, be devastated if that fell. Devastated. Food for tonight. Got a nice, fresh uh, chia batter. Got some nice. Oh, I've got a pork pie. I've got all about that. Got some thyme. This should be more. Got some seasoned olive oil. I've seasoned the food. That's chicken livers, um, bacon, mushroom, a touch of garlic. So, I'll let, uh, in fact, I'll put that in there. Yep, a touch of garlic. So chicken livers, bacon, mushroom, touch of garlic, a little bit of thyme, some chia butter. The chicken livers in. Mm. 
Right, so there we have it. Chicken livers, bacon, mushroom. Toast it to you, butter. That should be nicely toasted. Yep. And a mighty fine view. Chicken livers. Crispy bacon. Mmm. You hear that? Toast of cheese butter. Oh. Mmm. Right then. Cheers, everybody. You don't need to see me eat the rest of this. So, I'll spin you round. You can have a look at some uh, views. And I'll uh, tuck into this. Drink your wine. Happy Sunday. Very nice. As you can see, the light's starting to fade now. It's five past seven. I think we've got about 50 minutes of, of light, but obviously it's, it's gone behind the hills. I've got the brew on and I'm gonna just kick back I have a cup of tea and uh, I think it's bedtime so I'll see you in the morning. Take a look at that. What a morning. Anyway, while that's while the sun's doing its thing, I'm gonna get a brew on. Get me all my inside stuff packed away. It's a uh, quarter to seven. I need to be away early today, so face is numb. I've just been out. It's zero degrees. I've got the thermometer here. Strapped to the pole. Zero degrees out there, and it's right. The bag was open, Six, still 16 degrees, 16 degrees inside, so anyway, I'm going to get a brew on, I'm going to enjoy this sunrise, and um
Right then, guys. Almost finished this coffee. I'm almost packed up inside. So, I think when I shove them in the pack, and we'll get the tent down, and we'll, uh, we'll leave this place behind, because we've got... Got an hour and a half to get back to the car, otherwise we get charged. So, on that note, I'll leave you with this. Right then, guys, that's it. All packed away, tidied up. There's a little bit of a strap. There's that bottle of beer that I seen last night. That's in the pack. So I've had a quick look around. There's nothing there. So. So it's important to leave no trace to whichever knob left that. Anyway, right, so as you can see, a little bit of flat grass, that's it. It is 10 past 8, I need to get down there for 9 o'clock, so I'm going to have to run. So, thanks for watching, see you on the next one. Bye for now. Frozen. What a camp. So I'm on the way back down. I've got exactly 40 minutes. I'll need to pay. So I don't want to pay. Times are tough. So I'm going to get a move on. I'm going to get a move on I'm going to get down there just in time I'm going to head head somewhere for a bait and sandwich or a sausage sandwich with tomatoes with a few hash browns a nice cup of coffee or a cup of tea and then head back ready for night shift so if you like what you see Feel free to subscribe, like the video, and I'll see you on the next one. Bye for now. Hiding everything in life feels very fragile.